Good afternoon. This is Kaina. Today we are going to see how to create uh, discounts on the basis of customers. Suppose uh, we have a customer A. I want to give a discount uh, uh, one dollar for this customer. Okay. So how to do this uh, this, uh, this type of uh, setups uh, for this for this requirement? Okay. So. To set up uh, that requirement, we have to go to pricing administration. Then pricing administration. Then we have to go to pricing matrix. Okay, so we have to go to pricing manage matrix classes. You have to go to pricing term adjustment. We are uh, creating a discount on basis of customer. Okay, that's why uh, the price adjustment uh, has to be done. Then, so we have to create, we have to take condition, customer ID, better customer ID, because uh, in order management, the customer in ID will be available in the header section. That's why you have taken that uh, um, customer ID. Then we have to. So we have to take the uh, customer PVO. This is the view object. And key attribute is a party ID. Our party ID is nothing but a customer ID. So we are passing customer name in. Uh, because we are getting display attribute is a party name, that is a customer name. Okay. So we have to, uh, I will, this is the application module we have to take, like Oracle Apps, SCM, Pricing Farm, and Public Model, Application Module, Matrix, Domain Name. We have to take application module, this one. Okay. Then, so after creating this uh, condition, for, because we are doing for customers, that's why I have taken customer. Source code name is a passing customer ID and we are getting customer name. So this customer ID is in the header section. And I will show that uh, because in our management, we will. So in our management, we will we we have in customer uh, okay. So in I close this. So we have. Uh, Environment, we go to our environment. Customer name and uh, will be available in that header section. So we have taken that uh, we have taken that. Uh, because this is the customer is in the header section. This is our line. That's why we have taken um, customer ID. Okay. So we have taken in the header ID. Okay. So pricing adjustment term adjustment. Because we have taken customer ID. In header dot customer ID by because in order we have customer is in header section that's why I have taken customer but header dot customer ID okay then after creating this so we have to uh, create discount uh, pricing list for that for creating discount pricing list we have to go to manage the discount list.
we already created one disk only. Okay, so the discount list, our scissors, our item is uh, three simple item. We have given discount uh, one dollar. So we can give discount amount or discount percentage also we can do that, okay? So if you if I'm giving discount pricing, discount amount is a one dollar. So after that, we have to add this discount uh, list to the pricing strategy. Now what is a T pricing strategy? So in that we have to add uh, this. We have to add our this is our pricing strategy. This is um, this is the what this cone. We have to add uh, to this pricing strategy. Then the report discount list. We add this, okay. How is the discount list? How do we add this? Okay, so what you have done? We created, a, we went to create matrix classes and enabled that uh, for customers. Then after that, we created a discount list and we added that pricing, that discount list to the Pricing strategy. Okay. Total point. Then I will give all steps in one track. So discount list, you have to add this, uh, that whatever created a discount list, you have to add this here, add here. Then after that, because uh, whatever we have to go to manage customer pricing. Ours is a T test. Uh, T test customer. So, so this is the pricing customer for pricing profile. So after that, we have to go to manage pricing. Assign strategy assignment. Go to who header sales all. Then we have to add pricing strategy. We added uh, our discount list as well as the uh, normal list to the test pricing strategy so that uh, whenever we have you know, take that uh, customer, deep test customer. It will uh, it will discount one dollar on the price which has given for the particular item. Okay, I will show how much amount how much price has given for particular this uh, item. For that you have to um, go to T price list. Um, this is the T price list. In our is a T standard simple item. So, percentage T plus TS percentage. So we have given uh, three dollars. So we have given one dollar discount. Uh, so for four, so I am now uh, increasing to four to four. Then, so whenever created as uh, an order, it will give four minus one three dollars. Okay. So 
I'll try to see that. Our oh, fuse is in full light on. So we have to give it a view. This is standard item. Okay. See, three K. Okay. So if you want to change to percentage, okay. So we'll try to go to the discount uh, price. My free discount price. I will give our fees the key standard item. Yes, percentage. Okay, so we have given discount amount. Instead of that, I am giving percentage. I am giving you like uh, 0.3 percent, okay, uh, 50 percent. So, for uh, 50 percent is uh, for two two dollars. Four into 0 0.52, four minus two, two. So that it will give it will give two dollars now. the list price okay what is it this okay we'll see whether it will come or not so I'm giving two dollars fifty percent discount um, item so that uh, it had to come Now what we will do, we will try to cancel this item in order and try to create a one more order so that uh, we we'll see, so it is now 50 percent there because the item price has uh, four dollars. 50 percent discount it comes two dollars. Then four minus two, two dollars will come in that. Okay, four 50 percent of the item to two dollars. Five dollars is then two point five dollars will come. Then now our C is a test T standard okay. two dollars two dollars a kid. Right? What point right? So four uh, four dollar four dollars and fifty percent two dollars two dollars a kid. Okay. So this is the how to give discounts uh, for the customer. And uh, if it, you can add, like, we have one more scenario like that. Suppose uh, for T customer, I have to give 10%. For remaining customers, I have to give 20%. Or I have to give, have to give uh, 10% discount for this test customer, T test customer. For remaining, I don't, I don't want to create any discounts. That scenario will be taken tomorrow uh, so that uh, uh, we can know how to create a pricing list and how to build discounts of a particular customers. This is a, this is a qualified modifier that is called in uh, uh, EBS. So this is somewhat different uh, we configured in Fusion. Okay. So if you have any doubts, uh, please uh, write to me on the YouTube comment section. And uh, so that I can I can comment on that. Okay. Thank you.